Hello and welcome to Foundation. We're going to start a new uh, playthrough um, with this game here. Um, I played it in the past. In fact, I played it quite quite a time ago. And um, let's just go ahead and get started. We'll go ahead and go to the new game. We are going to do go into the original maps and pick uh, Coastal. And we'll confirm that. And I have some mods and enabled on this on this playthrough here. I've got a bunch of them, even some of them that I don't have, I have disabled that I've, I've chosen not to use. Um, but we're going to go ahead and go, just go with these. I'm going to run through them real quick. Common resources, foundation, extended building functions, balance trading, balance for realism, fantasy decorations, cathedral of St. Anne, common upgrades, vegetables and poultry farms, orchard, furniture, Efficient resource storage. Flax. Uh, house expansion set. Kitchen recipes. Livestock farms. Market slots. Mead from honey. Medieval fair. Medieval stone walls. Masonic life. Orthodox church. Nature decorations. Pagan worship. Rustic church rework. Skilled jobs. Street for farmers. Stumps. Swords and spears. Villager diversity and water sources. These are most of these are Bat Yushki um, mod packs. Uh, there, there was a mod pack A, mod pack B, and another mod pack. I, I basically downloaded those three packs, and you get all these things. You don't have you go then you could go through and pick each indiv individual ones you want to enable. But you, in order to enable some of them, you have to do. There's prerequisites you have to do. So, and, and that's what some of these will, will tell you here. Like this one here has uh, dependency, uh, not pre uh, dependency, common resources. In order to do that, I have to, the balance trading, I have to have common resources. And a few of them are like that. So, anyway, let's go ahead and start the game. Alright, a new beginning. After a long journey throughout your realm, your people finally reached new lands. Your lands, territories you were asked to settle for reasons of your own. Your villagers await your command. They are eager to advise your first steps, if you acquire so. Let me hear your advice. This is basically, they give you a tutorial to follow, and that's basically... All right, the first piece of advice comes from the eldest of your villagers. He suggests you consider basic needs when settling down. Berries for your people, stone and wood for your construction efforts. The rest will find its way. Put this advice to practice. Okay, you have a choice of picking one of these territories. It doesn't cost you anything, but this is your starting territory. Um, and you got just a few, if I could scroll out, this is the most I could do, okay. Uh, basically, what's in the hexagons is what your starting areas are. You got those. You got this one. Oh, I, I didn't want to pick it. Oh, damn. Damn, damn, damn. 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 Ugh. I, yeah, I usually go... I usually like to start with this one here, but I, I fucked up. <laughs> damn it. Okay, well, I ain't nothing I can do about it now. Let's just go ahead and I'll just go ahead and go with it because I'll, I'll get a second one here pretty soon. And I could actually, this might be okay because I'll be able to get maybe this here or maybe it might be better to go ahead and go, route, go this route here. Um, but anyhow, let's go ahead and I need to pick a village center and that's going to have to be this right here. I think I'm going to stick this right, right here. We'll build that, and um, village aspirations. Have 100 citizens or more in your village. Reach a population of 1,000. I can actually try. This is this is all um, th uh, things to expire to quest. I guess you could say. Um, I could keep just click on that to, to kind of check on my progress on that stuff. Um, do I have anything? Not yet. I got the. Um, what are we waiting on? I think I need to go ahead and click the speed up to speed number three. Um, usually we 
have something to do. What, what's the paint? No. Build. There's nothing to build. Nothing that that I need, or and I don't want that. Okay. The second pl the second piece of advice comes from a young inter enterprising villager. Rather than simply letting everyone fend for themselves, she suggests you organize laborers in workspaces. Builders in their workshop, woodcutters at their lumber camp, berry gatherers at their hut, and so on. Let's put this advice to practice. And we got the building builders workshop first. And uh, let's scroll up a little bit. And I will twist this around to where that's the front. Um, I'm trying to figure out where would be a good place to put it. I think probably be. I want to. I think I'm going to go this route here. So let's go ahead and place it right up against here. And we'll build that. And let's go ahead and start with three villagers. Or three builders. Um, and what do we get here? We got extraction zone. We're going to extract the all of these trees because we're going to need all the trees. Is there any tree? Yeah, there's trees here. Let's get these. Let's get the stones while they're here. And there's, there's going to be bushes. We're going to get those. Is there a tree? Yeah, there's a few trees here. So let's grab the, get those cut too. Oh, let's cut these trees up here. Okay, now what else is, what's next? The wood, wood lumber camp. Uh, we're going to put the lumber camp. Um, I, I want to put that. I want to cut. I'm, I'm going to go this route here, and I'm going to probably cut all these trees as well here. So let's just go ahead and um, let's position this. Try. I try to position these. The arrows. That's the back of it. We'll go. We'll pop that there. Because <coughs> you get your second second territory, which is free as well, relatively early. In fact, it, it's pretty quick. Okay, we'll go ahead and assign. We'll go with three work three of uh, woodcutters now. Traction, reforestation. I don't really want to do the reforestation quite yet. Uh, the gathering hut I do want to do. But let's go ahead and move the gathering hut. And we, then we're going to put it right close to the berries. I'll build that. Let's go ahead and we don't need a lot of just maybe we'll put one well we'll put in th three of them right now we'll, we'll end up taking three up probably two of them out for right now I mean later on all right now that you have organized your laborers you can see to their needs and happiness make sure they have access to fresh water and housing as for food you will first need people to store and distri distribute the berries they collected. From there, your village will have everything to welcome its first wave of migrant immigrants. Okay, we got that. Let's go ahead and what's um, the granary? But I want a bit of stone cutter too. I think the stone cutter is going to go about right. I want to position it right. There. <coughs> and um, we need to do the granary. We'll just do one stone cut minor for right now. The granary is going to go the front of it's where the 
I think it's where this right where the uh, the the winch is. So we're gonna put the put that right. We're gonna drop that right there. And there's the cutting the trees already. Let's. I am going to have to put a a forester cap. The forester cap really doesn't need to go. We'll go with that there. Yeah, the greater, okay, the tra oh, we need one transporter. Uh, am I out of people? I, I probably am. Um, let's, let's go ahead and assign the resource. Let's do two berries, and we'll put the meat down at the bottom one. We'll probably put another berry there, too. Um, let's go into this and see what I got here. I got... I got three builders. I don't need all these foragers, so let's um, let us sign that guy and make it a make him a transporter. <coughs> all right, we'll put the forester camp. That's done. Let's put him up here, and that's already is that already done? Holy cow! Yeah, it, it is. I don't want to do pines. We'll put the, take the pines off. I don't think the other ones really matter, but I, I kind of like to keep them all the same kind. We'll go with oaks for this this area here. Um, and I need to probably go with the woodcutter. Take the woodcutter off and assign a forester. I can only do one forester. <coughs> What else we got going on? Oh, now it's time for the new territory. This will this will highlight here when it's ready for a new territory. Ooh, that's not really one I wanted. I thought it would be more. Ew. You know what? I think we're going to go with with this. Yeah, we'll do that. Now we got to start thinking about residentials and um, market stalls. Um, first off, let's go ahead and extract all of this stuff here I really want more there's more stone up here and more berries so that that's a good thing there um, where do I want to put the residential? I'm thinking probably down over here. I, I actually would like to have them right here. But my God, I don't want to have to... Uh, we got to put a... We'll put a... We'll put a well there first. Okay, we'll build the well. And we'll start building houses. Put that there. <coughs> and um, in order to get houses, you have to zone it for residential first. So let's just go ahead and we'll just do this right here. And we need to do some reforestation. This is this. I'll have a more area, larger area for that over here. 
when that time comes. Alright, we got our first house over here. They got the well built. No ac no access to food. Oh, I gotta get a, I gotta get a market stall. Um. So put the stall there. Bring that up. Add a sub building, which would be a market stalls court. Um, we need this, and we will move this around to. The arrows is where the customers go, and the white ball is where the the attendant will be. So we'll put that there. We'll put the uh, tent above it, and we'll build that. We got some houses being built. Let's see if let's extract even more or make more residential area. That'll work. If it come down to it, I could add this to it too. I, I like to keep the area kind of together. <coughs> You know, they're, they're planting trees. That's what the um, reforestation do. What am I doing here? Oh, I got to get another. Oh, I got to do another wood, woodcutter. No, transporter, miner, forester, forager, forager. God, I'm down to, to one person almost on everything. Let's go ahead and, and hopefully I'll get a person coming in pretty quick. Some new settlers. How we set on our, we got 151 berries. We need to start thinking about, I'm going to have to, the, the next one, next territory will have to be this so that I could get some, um, oh, well, like, yeah, from fishing stuff, fishing hats going. Um, so where would go where, where I could. Okay, this one look for a warehouse. I need to unlock the warehouse. And... Well, here I might as well unlock the fishing too. We'll do that. All right, now we could get some. Now we could get the. Um, oh, I got assigned resources. That's why. And I could do two. This is one of the um, the mods that I got. Usually it's just one per one per stall, but but now I could do two per stall. So I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put fish. Let's put meat on there for now. I could change that later. Um, in order to purchase another t territory, I need. I think it costs. Yeah, five. I need, I need 500 coins to buy another territory. So that's going to be something I will have to do later. We are on the great the warehouse now. So we want the warehouse. I think we're going to put the warehouse about right here. I think that would make make the most sense. And we'll build that. I gotta kind of keep an eye on my my tools because a lot of these things require tools, and I don't have no way to get tools right now until I get the market, until I'm able to start trading. Um, set on the. Extraction. If I, I got that extracting, I didn't think extracting much. I, I ain't got that many. What do we What do we got here? Oh, I got the fishing head already. I don't have no way to access the thing. So I mean the um, the coastline. So there's no sense in doing that. I need to get. Why am I not getting any villagers? Raise the happiness of your village is 75, currently 61. That's what it is. Okay. My happiness is right here. So I got when that gets to 75, I'll start getting getting my uh, new people to my village. 
and um, warehouse is built so I need to add another person to it but I don't have cloth tools uh, tools is one thing I really want uh, wood um, stone I don't really need cloth quite yet so let's just we'll just go with that for right now um, let's see what we got here villagers can I put somebody else in there market no it's got one I got one builder one forger I got two foragers I guess it'll have to be you you dude <coughs> And it's, I guess I, well, I'm just waiting for 75% to get on the happiness. No workers assigned. What, what are my, what's, what am I missing on the workers? I don't have anybody in the forester camp. I do not. Well, that's fine. I must have took somebody out. Uh, I got one there. One builder. One mark is tall. Hmm. I don't got no miners either. Well, it's time for some new people coming in here. <laughs> I'm getting close. It's about. I'm about to hit it. All right. Which way do the, these people come in? I wonder. You'll see them. They'll have a big old round thing, circle on them, when they they'll walk in. Edge of the map. All right, we hit it. Okay. see anybody coming to the village so there they are they're gonna come this way and down this way probably it takes them a while to walk but I'm gonna need to get okay profiting from trade a business might establish a trade route with your closest neighbor Northbury this will let you sell resources for profit and buy in when you need so the you just start with planks since Norbert needs those. Okay, we'll do that. What do we got here? Alright, we got a sawmill I get a, I need to put in. For, for right now I need to wait till these guys come in. I need to assign these to the I need a stone. <coughs> I need more I really need more than these guys, but I need to click on them. And we'll sign one to this, and then one to the, to them. But I really need God. I really need more. Hopefully, more will come in soon. I got the warehouse built. Sign planks to the warehouse. Okay. Well, that I I got I did that, didn't I? No, I did not. Did then. All right. Planning a trade route. All right. Unlock a trade route to trade berries. Allow the sale of berries from the trade resource tab. Okay, now we're going to go to the trade resource tab. And that would be no. Yeah, this is it. There's Northberry. We I got to get 20, 20 um, planks in order to unlock this. So that's going to be a. You know, let's if I remember how to do this. Um, stack maximum. Oh, I gotta get. I gotta build the damn sawmill first. Okay. Well, that was silly. I need to put that.
I'm gonna need a a, a um what what is this called? Oh, I I won't know until it comes up. Oh, here, here comes another person. Good. I really need more than just one. I'm gonna need to get some. Um, you're gonna have to go and be a. Um, well, there's two of them here. Okay, that's even better. I need a woodcutter. And hopefully another one will come soon. <coughs> Let's um, add the residential area like I said I was going to earlier. I don't want to go too far up here because that's getting close to, to the, the, mo the stones and and that will not be an ideal area to build housing. I should be building housing over here anyhow. I should have put the well over here, I think. <laughs> oh, I, don't want to, I want to click on the, not the person. There, well, that's what I want right there. I need, I need another builder. I should have probably, yeah. Let's 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 change a builder to let's make a builder out of one of those wood cutters. Add the builder there. <coughs> I got five cloth. <coughs> I got residential here, don't I? Okay, we've got new, new, new cupboards. So let's get uh, another builder and go back to make another wood cutter. All right. They are upgra already already upgrading houses. This is going to lock this. I get this. This will include all this area here. All right, we got the carpenter. Let's, um, yeah, I don't. I'm gonna have to just do one of the. All right, now we got planks going. Let's pause it for a second. All right, let's go ahead. This is one thing I like about this game more so than I like uh, with Planet Base. Because Planet Base, you can't really pause anything. This game, you need to pause. And it really, it makes it a, a quality of life decision they made in making this game a really a big plus. Did I not extract? Yeah, this is extracted here. It's not doesn't seem to want to. This is all being extracted, so. Here come two more people. That's good. 
Uh, we need, um... Anything new? Sawmill, don't need, stonecutter camp. Nothing there. Um, no. <coughs> nope, okay. So that means I'm gonna, I'm gonna maybe do another stone cutter. Add a stone, a miner actually, I guess that's actually technically what that's called. Um, let me think. What do I want? Maybe, um, that took care of the two. So let's do that. Let's go with that. <coughs> How are we set on planks? We're up to six planks. Maybe I should have put somebody. I don't think I got any, anybody else to put on there, though, but I don't. We'll just wait for the next one, next person to come in. All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this episode up here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button. Um, and uh, leave a comment below. I like to hear feedback. So anyway, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.